All right, welcome to my How Is It Reactive series. In this episode, I'll be covering the Sticker Star Wrap. As you can see here, it is both animated and reactive. It says, approved by the United Unicorn Council. So you can clearly see the animation on this. You've got some awesome stars of multiple different colors dropping down throughout the weapon. And when you trigger it, they almost all turn white. And I think that's how it's reactive, but we're going to check in game just to see if it really looks like this. Because sometimes this is totally not what it looks like in game. Now, since it is mostly pink on the wrap, and then a little bit of that bluish teal, I am going with the Starly skin, who also has pink and a darker pink and then a teal, but plus her star on her shirt changes colors. Pretty sweet. And then for a back bling, I'm going with the pink animated and reactive star power. For the pickaxe, I'm doing the rift edge. And for the glider, the rose rider. Pretty sweet. All pink. Let's see what it looks like in game. All right, so here we go. Looks like it's almost nighttime too. Ooh, the Rose Rider is just a bit lighter than I anticipated. Let's see if we can find some weapons and take a peek at this camo. I'll show it both in the daylight as well as at nighttime. All right, so the sun is going down, so let's take a peek real quick. Oh yeah, I really, really enjoy that pink color. That is pretty sweet. Here's the SMG. So the animation is nice, very, very nice. All right, let's see what it does when we shoot. Yep, I guess it's just like what we saw on the display. Basically, everything turns a whitish color, except for the background, of course. So all the stars, instead of coming down in a barrage of colors, including orange, my favorite, they just turn all white. And that's not too bad. See what it looks like in the dark now. All right, so here we are in the darkness. Look at this. Obviously, the stars start shining a bit more brighter. You can see all the different colors. I really like the tip because it's orange and yellow. You can see it much better on the shotgun though. Here, let me swap to that. Now look when you pull the shotgun out. Like the entire tip is just orangish yellow. I love it. Let's see if we can notice the stars better on this one. Yeah, they all turn like white, I guess. That's the best way to describe it. It's not too bad. I'll have to go into replay mode and see if it looks any better there, but... Nothing that we haven't really seen before. I mean, we have had items exactly like this before, where there's color on the animation, and then when you shoot, they just turn a bright white. And that seems to be what happens here as well. However, the original animation here and the color scheme is just nice. I truly love this. There's not too many pink camos in the game, yet there are a lot of pink skins. So you could use this nicely to complement some of your pink skins. Not bad. So there you go. That's all there is to it. How would I rate this camo? I'd probably say an 8 out of 10. Now, to be honest, the reactivity to it is not that good. It only turns the stars white. Nothing really unique or special about that. The reason I rank it so high is because it is that rare pink color for the camo. And like I said, there's tons of pink skins out there. Now, if you throw in the animated stars, which are also a barrage of colors, it just makes for a great wrap to match with other skins. Now, would I pay 500 V-Bucks for this? Absolutely. Animation is great. Color scheme is great. Reactivity is so-so. Put it all together, and I'd say this is definitely worth 500 V-Bucks, and I rank it, like I said, an 8 out of 10. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated, and don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.